Good morning, and the picket line has just begun this morning. Members of both unions, we've got SAG members out here, as well as WGA members. This started at 9 o'clock this morning. And for SAG members, this is coming up in almost a month since they went on strike for the WGA. As you said, this is now day 102. This surpasses the 2007-2008 strike, which estimated to be costing anywhere from 2 to $3 billion to the local economy. So yesterday, there was a message that was sent to WGA members from the negotiating committee that said that they were going to go back to the bargaining table, that they had received a message from the AMPTP to come back to the bargaining table. So they will be meeting today, and uh, they suggested that they they want to make sure that all of their issues are addressed. The, the negotiating committee saying that they were not going to back down. We talked to some members yesterday who were on the picket lines. Here's what they had to say. Last week they met and nothing came of it and it didn't surprise me. But the last time we talked it wasn't really anything good. So <laughs> I'm being realistic but also hopeful that they'll come with a fair deal for us. What about a car insurance? What about a house and mortgage? What about food? Honk if you watch TV and movies. We need somebody like Arnold Schwarzenegger coming upstairs with us. So here's what uh, the negotiating committee with the WGA sent to its members via an email or the website. They said, we expect the AMPTP to provide responses to WGA proposals. Our committee returns to the bargaining table ready to make a fair deal, knowing the unified WGA membership stands behind us and buoyed by the ongoing support of our union allies. No official statement from the AMPTP side, the studio side, regarding the resumption of these labor uh, talks. What we do know is that the two sides do remain far apart on several key issues, residuals for streaming content, the, min, uh, the subject of minimum staffing for projects, and artificial intelligence. But the good news is that both sides are back at the bargaining table as of today. It's the first time since the writers have been on strike that the both sides are meeting together. So as I've been saying, Sandra and Araxia, there is a glimmer of hope. There's some optimism, yet there is skepticism that this could still last a very long time. It's sad that this has become sort of normalized, right? That you're going to all these studios and all across town. You see uh, both members of the WGA and SAG-AFTRA walking those picket lines, and that will likely continue for us. Uh, for some time. Yeah, and it's people's livelihoods, Bob. Of course, it's a big issue, and hopefully, some progress will be made. Thank you.